Here we are taking a look initially at some of Roy's work and I'm going to see if I can make this camera zoom in. I'm just learning to operate it but take a look now at some of the detail work you can see in the platter that's in the back and I'll, I'll pull it out just a little further. You see the, you see the stand that that platter is sitting on that, that's handmade by Roy. The glazes that you see on the work are handmade by Roy. And look closely at the texture that we see in that platter. Let me zoom in here again and uh, take, a, take a better look at that. And I, I put the camera on a tripod because I was shaking around so much. I, I hope you can see what you're looking okay, at. There we go. Now look at, the, look at the little teeny tiny pieces of mosaic he has in there in this design all broken pieces of pottery that he's now incorporated into this fabulous little mosaic window sort of piece including the stand that it's sitting on all made by hand by Roy and I'm gonna move over here now we're gonna look at some of Roy's platters shake shake there we go here's a nice platter also on a handmade stand Backing off here, you can almost see the whole platter. Now I'm going to zoom in. Look at the intricate detail work in this platter. See those, oops, sorry. You see those oak leaves drawn in there? They are just beautiful. They're, they're not like pressed in or traced on. They're drawn in into the clay with a tool that Roy has devised. Sometimes he uses iron working tools, sometimes wire brushes, sometimes porcupine quills. You name it, he uses it. And here is another piece. I don't know if you can really see the texture. I'm going to kind of move in really close here. There's a lot of light reflecting off of it. Look at the texture in this. Absolutely beautiful. Once again, these markings on the pot almost look like leather but trust me they are not they are clay down inside that pot you see the pot is unglazed on the outside down inside that pot see that reflection down there that's glaze that's glaze absolutely beautiful you see this open vase style piece once again setting in its own stand, handcrafted by Roy. You see the oak leaves drawn into the side. Gorgeous work. Absolutely gorgeous. And here, this is the final piece we'll look at of Roy's today. Look at this magnificent pot. Beautiful deep red color in the glaze. And moving in here once again, look again at this oak leaf pattern carved into the clay. The rope texture carved into the clay. That's not a piece of rope. That is texture carved into the clay. The entire top of the lid beautifully crafted. Look at that beautiful oak leaf. Gorgeous. Roy Brown. Glencoe, New Mexico. Find him at Angel Fire Art Space Gallery. Thanks. If you have questions about Roy, let me know. Go to my website, send me an email, give me a call, find all my numbers right on the site. It's Catherine McDermott, and I'll see you next time.